Hello, I am back again for my six monthly video that I like to post. <laughs> um, just doing a wee vlog because I am in Glasgow for Transmit this weekend and I thought it would be fun to vlog because I don't vlog my daily life because I don't really get up too much when I'm back home but yes. Hello, hi, welcome, if you're new. My name's Kiri and I hope you enjoy my video. Um, I fit for day one of Transmit. I've got this wee cowboy hat from Boohoo with these dangly earrings and this wee necklace and then the dress is from Motel Rock and it's like it's a mini dress and then this belt from Boohoo as well I think and then I'm just wearing my Doc Martens because it's supposed to be very muddy and I don't really want to get any I was going to wear cowboy boots but they get really wrecked and I'm just not not here for that. But yeah, all ready for day one. My makeup looks extremely harsh in that light, but I promise it's not a bad. But yeah, we're gonna go very soon because Melbourne starts in like half an hour. But our hotel is actually only, like you can see the festival from where we're staying. And we actually got VIP tickets this year which i didn't have last year so i'm very excited about that just to see what the difference is and see if i have nice toilets because the toilets last year were not it so bad but Finishing touches, perfume. This is the nicest perfume you'll ever smell in your whole life. Just an FYI. Yes, I will. I'll, um, I don't actually know if I'm going to video in there because I'll be scundered. I'm not bringing my camera, but I might record some. Hey, everyone. We are at the fancy VIP yeah, toilet. They have sinks, that's, the, uh, why, that's how privileged we are at this concert. We have sinks in our bathrooms. So I would also say this, very worth it if you're gonna okay. splurge. Very, very worth it. So much nice food places and the bar is so quick compared to the normal ones. And now the was so good. Did you just feel more privileged? What? You just feel more privileged. No, I actually do. See, having a sink in the toilet, it's just, it makes it's life. It's just like, thank you. Hell better. I appreciate it's that. like, oh, wow. But yeah, now I'm just bad. Very, very good. Sorry for the dinner angle. I have the link strapped onto the sink with the tripod thing. But <clears throat> day one was very good. However, we didn't really know like many. Well, we knew them, but like we didn't really go see a lot, like everyone that was doing it. We went to see Nal Horn and then it was so good. See my wee younger direction herself. Just putting on her string. It was fantastic. And then George Ezra was after that. We weren't really. really like George Ezra. We just went and chilled in the VIP section for that part. And then went to see Pope. 
I think I need like three songs off, but they were actually very good. And tomorrow, I want to see like most people that are playing, so I'm going to have a busy day. I'm going to have to go really early. Well, not, I say really early, I mean like three, but we're going to be there all day. But it was very good. And I'm just going to take my makeup off now and get ready for bed. Is half left. It's so good though. The hotel we booked is literally down the street from the concert, so it, it's just a 10 minute walk. Skittery catch up. I'm like, it's around your Because, as expected, I forgot to record anything today. It's like half seven. We just seen the beach, it was the best. An inhaler on before him, and now we're waiting for kissing again and something. Outfit, really a stress in this waistcoat, but my makeup looks mental in this camera. Um, just getting ready to bed. It is quarter past four. The cooks are coming on at five. I'm gonna see them, but then there's no one else that we really like on until the 1975 are headlining later. So, hopefully get a wee bit more vlogging done in the actual festival today because I keep forgetting. I'm always too busy and, and too much of a rush. So I get back to you when with <laughs> Last night was the best night of my whole life, 1975. Well, mm, that's a bit dramatic. Harry Styles was the best night of my whole life. But, um, the 1975 were amazing. The whole weekend in general was actually really good, but I realised this morning that I don't probably have very much vlog footage so this video probably was really short so apologies but we're ready our flight's not actually till like two o'clock so it's still got like three hours and i don't think you have to be in the airport until like an hour before your flight so that's fun because we have nowhere to go after we checked out <clears throat> I also realised that I haven't done a room tour the hotel room yet because I stayed in this hotel last year when we came here and I'll be honest with you, it wasn't very good but they've got renovated since the last it wasn't awful last year but like it just wasn't gorge but they've renovated as you can see the room's quite nice behind me so once I fix my hair I'll give you a room tour also, there's a train track right outside our room, and it has been the most annoying thing ever. 
this whole weekend. And the kitchen is even the paper with it right now. It's so annoying. Also, for the heck of me having to go home, there's actually another wristband tucked into that one. But I don't want to look like I have 20,000 wristbands on one because they're boring. Because we didn't, we can't fly with scissors or nothing, so we don't have any scissors to like take them off because you have to get like a different VIP wristband uh, each like day. Like <laughs> <laughs> Literally, like there's another one underneath this one and it sits like here. And do you know when you were a kid and you used to wear like bracelets the way up your arm? That's the energy it's given and I'm really not here for it, I'll be honest. But this little mirror. Sorry, I just I said already that I was gonna do a room tour, but I didn't really announce that there. Do a room tour. This is the front door when you come in and then it has this cute little mirror for some idea pics. Then it's got just your wardrobe and coffee machine and all that. But we actually didn't realise the entire time we've been here, the room has had a stocked mini fridge. But we've been going and buying snacks like every night because for when you come back and we've been here the whole time. So then you do the old pan. Here's our lovely bed. Nice decoration on the wall. Like I'm not even joking, you can see when I came here last year, this it was like the most basic hotel room you could ever have in your life like it wasn't nice at all but now it's like lovely although I will say like see that hotel there I've stayed there before and I love it but I didn't realize how close it was to this one because I stayed here I chose this hotel because it was really close to the festival but I didn't realize that the other one was literally across the road so I could have stayed there too that's probably my favorite hotel I've stayed in in Glasgow and sadly I didn't know to book it before we got here but if I come back next year I will be staying over there. Even though this hotel is like, quite nice but just like that one better. But back to the room tour. So that's like the whole men's chair and desk and stuff here. And then the gorgeous bathroom. Because I really, I don't know about everybody else but I really judge hotels by if the bathroom's nice. Like see it's got an ugly bathroom at the mm. bad. But yeah, it's got a light up mirror and all to do your makeup. Not that I used to because I like to sit at the window to do my makeup, but like if you want to use it, it's here for you. Lovely green tag. Yeah that's our hotel room. Hope oh. he's enjoyed it. If this vlog was probably like a shambles to be honest. Because I don't really know what I vlogged and what I didn't. But hope you've enjoyed anyway. And um, thank you so much. I definitely said goodbye and ended this vlog when I was in the hotel room. But I need to tell you it's about this Starbucks saga that I've been having this entire weekend. Um, they keep calling me Kaylee. For some reason, I don't know the way I pronounce my name. It sounds like I'm saying Kaylee and not Katie. But every Starbucks I have ordered this entire weekend, which have been a lot because I'm a wee bit of a problem with Starbucks. But like literally every Starbucks I've ordered has been killing. And it hasn't just been this, there's been various different spells of it too. So, but I'm just let you know. This is a case of red for this random green drink I have. It's an ice matcha with vanilla. Delicious. If you don't know, get to know. Thank you.